mean, we've been through a lot of battles together. Uh, championship games, hard fought wins, hard losses. A lot of basketball moments. Uh, like Zach said, we had a lot of good moments, a lot of bad moments. It's like my brother, for real. Uh, we have an amazing understanding, come from the same culture, have a good understanding on and off the court with basketball and just like the lifestyle. Brotherhood, understanding, you know, loyalty runs deeper than just playing with somebody, you know. You can't knock Zach off for like his routine. I respect that a lot about him. Like he don't care where we at, what we doing. He gonna do what he gotta do when it comes to his routine and no matter what it is. So I respect that about bro. Like he, you know, he gonna make sure he get his, his work done or whatever the situation, he gonna get it done. His confidence in any situation, you know, he gonna come out, he gonna do what he does no matter what. No matter the game, no matter the situation, he gonna be unshaken. I just don't show no emotion. I don't know, I be, I be locked in, I just be focused. Obviously that takes a lot of reps, a lot of successes and failures, but all of it's the same to him. And so it's definitely helped change my mindset when it comes to situations like this. Obviously playing together for three years helps that as well but his confidence to any situation is huge. So I try to take that and just continue to grow with that. When I started playing sports, my the people that used to bring me to my games, because my mom was always at work, so people used to bring me to my games, they'd be like, you're not playing with like emotion or passion. Like You don't need to be playing. It's a lot of crazy things going on in the world, but I want to be able to show my passion and fun for the game. And, bring that energy out of my teammates and put that into the culture of whatever team that I'm on. So I'm diving on the floor, jumping over things. My mind is all the way into the game. I don't think of nothing else. I wake up thinking about the game, thinking about what I gotta do. I just try to just be there for my teammates. I try to be the glue guy. I try to make everything connect together because every game is different. Not every game you're gonna score 30 points. So I want to be the guy that's just the most reliable and everything else that comes to helping people, helping guys be the best version of themselves. And so it takes a lot. It takes your body, blood, sweat, and tears, emotions. So for me, I just write things that like pertain to me to where I can help be the best version of myself. You know, it's a lot of people that like give like notes or give things to try to help everybody and stuff like that. And that's good. I take that information in as well. But then again, I want to be able to learn myself and like, I can't guard a certain player the way that KP can because I'm a different player. So I just do the right things that help pertain to me to be able to help me get advantage to help my team win. A lot of work, uh, a lot of dreaming. Some of the stuff I went through in my life just with just like my basketball career. I didn't dream a lot of this and envisioned a lot of it. You gotta have the confidence to, to really, you know, take certain shots and work on certain shots to hit certain shots. So that's kind of like what I pride myself on, just like my work ethic. Um, and that's it, just understanding that I'm really, really good at what I do. You know, just keeping that, that sense of confidence in a humble way, you know. Just trying to work as hard as possible.